Shopify has released a new feature that allows you to 3D scan any object and put it right into your website. This allows your customers to see your products from every single angle while they rotate them and see every single detail of it. But is this a good feature? I don't know. I'm going to try it for the first time with you guys and we're going to create a 3D model of this item. Hey guys, it's the Econ Bull here, so let's get started in 3, 2, 1, yeah! Alright, so we're gonna go ahead and open our Shopify app, and in here we're gonna click on 3D Scanner. To access this, you're gonna have to update to version iOS 17 on your phone. If not, it won't work. And it tells us that we need to have a well-lit area with indirect soft lighting. We also need to have enough space for you to circle around your product and also up to 20 minutes. Let's try it out. Let's set up a well-lit area. All right, so I have my set ready to go. I am a little bit concerned because there's good lighting here, but there's a little bit of shadows on the back. So I don't know how the app will interpret that. Also, when I move around it, I will probably cast some shadows, so I have to be really careful with that. So it's telling us to move close and center the dot on your product, then tap continue. All right, so there we go, continue. Boom. All right, so it created the boundaries. So move around to ensure the whole product is inside the box. Drag handles to resize. All right, so yeah, I think that's inside. I don't know if this side is inside maybe i have to move this one a little bit okay it actually kind of like moves it by itself i don't even have to touch it it kind of learns by itself wow oh my gosh this is pretty impressive wow okay so i think that's good i think the the boundary box is good so let's click on start scan Move slowly around your product. All right, so let's start moving. You can see how it is <laughs> replicating the image there. Man. What the heck? There are some lines over here, kind of like at the bottom that haven't been completed. Okay, so let me, okay, now it's completed. Okay, so scan one complete. So let's continue. Scan from a lower angle. Move down to be level with the base of your product and scan. All right, let's see. So I am base here. Okay, scan two completed. Oof. All right, let's continue. Scan from a higher angle. Move above your product and make sure that areas you captured previously can still be seen. All right, let's try it. I don't know why it's not getting that line. Okay, got it, finally. All right. What else? What else do we need? Okay, over here. There's another line that is missing. Get it, get it. Yes, yes. Scan 3 complete. In the next step, keep the app open until the 3D model is completed. All right, let's click on continue. And let's wait. Let's see. Building 3D model. it's done so let's see review your 3d model oh my god <laughs> wow this looks amazing oh my gosh even with the shadow man if i had a light behind there it would have looked perfect but oh my gosh this looks amazing wow oh don't tell me that i can put it Oh my gosh, I can put it in any surface. Can you believe this? It's like, it's right there, but it's not. Ah, you can't see it. Wait, hold on. So I have it there, but I'm going to move it 
right here where the other one was. Can I rotate it? Yes, I can rotate it. I put it at 100% size. Let's see if it's actual real size. So I have the other one side by side. Okay, so it's, if I put it right next to each other, oh my gosh, it's pretty much the same exact size. So you can measure it. If you do this AR simulation and you want to buy something for your house, you just get your phone, put this item. Let's see how it will look if I put it over there. <laughs> oh my gosh, it will look like that. Okay, what about if we put it there? So let's grab it. Here, put it, put it right there. There you go. Oh my gosh. Can we put it inside of this? I don't think so, right? No, but we can put it on, kind of on top. Let's just put it here on the table over there. Wow. This is gonna help so much in so many niches. Like, of course, home decor is gonna be good for this, but also other niches like, I don't know, vehicle parts or, uh, no, you, you can just imagine. Wow, this is amazing. Here's the real one, side by side. Wow, look at that. You can't even tell which one is real. This is amazing. I'm gonna put it now on a website, okay? A testing website. And we're gonna see the user experience on desktop. Let's check it out right now. All right, before we do that, we have an option here to save to files app. All right, let's click on that. Move. All right, it's moved. But what happened? Where can I see it now? All right, so let me just open one random product and try to add another media. On here, you see this option, Files App? Let's click on that. And there we have it, right there. Let's click on Open. Let's just save it. Uploading file. It seems like it finished uploading. So let's go to the desktop and check it out. All right, guys. So now let's see how this will look on our back end and also on the front end website. So let's first look at the back end. So we're here on our Shopify back end. We'll go to products and let's choose the product where we imported that file. All right. So it's right here and we can already see it in here. So let's click on it and zoom in. Wow. Amazing. Wow, I am out of words right now. Like this used to be so complicated to do just a couple years ago. The way technology is advancing, it's unbelievable. And all of this was done with just a phone, with, with an iPhone 14 Pro. I think it has to be the Pro because it has to have the LiDAR. I'm not too sure, but I will assume because how else can you get all this depth without 3D scoping it by hand. Like, look, look at the eyes. You see how it has depth and look at this also, you know, this brim over here. And of course the textures, you know, that was amazing. And this would have looked a lot better if I had proper lighting. And I can see here that there's some options here like lighting, studio lighting, city lighting. Oh, wow, look, this one looks pretty good. The city light lighting, uh, park sunrise see it changes a little bit warmth i'm gonna leave it with a uh, city lighting you know i think it's very similar to reality also you can change here the exposure and all of that let's leave it like that and also you can choose a background wow let's just use transparent background and also here you have some options for camera zoom rotation okay so i'm guessing like here you will specify uh, the the picture that appears first so i'm just gonna choose a good angle here for the product maybe something like this and let's click here on edit file and we'll just click on done so it saves it all right okay so that's good let's close this page now let's actually delete this uh, image here this is just a testing product on a testing website so it doesn't really matter it looks pretty blown out but let's see how it will actually look so let's click here to see the preview on the product page and it just loaded right there but let's see what happens if we click here all right so now we can move it wow you can zoom in you can even put it full screen wow amazing even the texture man look at the texture you can of course you cannot see the individual hairs of this item right but 
you can kind of see a pretty good texture mapping in here. This is amazing. Let's click on escape. Wow. All right, guys. So, you know, this is actually pretty amazing. You know, Shopify, well done. You know, you did it good. And by the way, if you don't have a Shopify store or you're making a new one, check out the link that I have on the description of the video where you can get Shopify free for three days and also three months for only one dollar per month. OK, so, you know, Shopify is building for the future, so I am safe recommending it. And also make sure to like this video and also subscribe for more content like this. Now, this was a little bit of an experimental video that I did, you know, kind of like in the field testing something. But, you know, it would be nice if you comment me if you like this kind of approach to new features of Shopify or if you prefer me sitting here just explaining everything through my screen. Now, watch this video because it's also about e-commerce and you're gonna love it. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I'm out.